07 Citizens Black here, and today I wanted to offer up a quick guide for new players or just players who might need some quick gear and don't feel like running a bunker or paying for it. This will be especially convenient if you're on Microtech, as that is the planet this will work on for now. More details on that in a moment though. But first, if you like my quick guide, ship reviews, and ship loadout videos, or my news flashes to keep you up to date with the latest news, please consider liking, subscribing, and commenting as it helps me conquer the evil overlords at YouTube who try to put a stranglehold on my videos due to their quick run times. But now with all that out of the way, let's get to the guide. So to begin with, as mentioned a moment ago, this currently works on Microtech, but I think it'll be expanded out to other planets in the next couple of patches. So I would expect this to be a quick method that will be a system-wide thing in the very near future. This method is simple. You go to any of the new outposts on Microtech and kill the NPCs there to take their armor and weapons. Now, I know what you're thinking. If there's NPCs there and I'm only wearing my white undersuit and helm, how can I take them out and easily get this armor and weapons you speak of? That's easy. Just use your ship to kill the NPCs. I mean, that's pretty much the guide right there. At this point, you can check out the sister guide to this one, which will point you in the direction of these so far four known abandoned colonial outposts that I will link at the end of this video. But if you want to see a little footage in action of me doing it and you need more tips, because I actually offer a bunch of tips here, then keep on watching and you'll see how I handle things that came up and which of the outposts I recommend doing first. So for those who don't know, these outposts are around Microtech in a few areas and are just little camps where NPCs will spawn and walk around a bit, patrolling the camp. Some of the NPCs are kind of hidden inside some of the structures or up in the guard tower, and some are just standing around doing nothing. I've seen as few as one or none to as many as six or seven. Now, if you travel to one and don't see anyone there, then you can either move on to the next location or wait around a few minutes as they usually spawn back in, but I'm not sure of the timer. But I have killed some and seen some show up again within five to ten minutes. Again, this could be timer based on if someone was there before me or killed one or not, I'm not sure how those spawn times are set. Another thing you can also do is just to log out of your bed if you have one on your ship close by and then log back in and see if you're on a new server. Now another thing that can happen either before you get there or even during is that an NPC driven ship can arrive to offer backup to the NPCs. Now as of this video they don't actually fly around and chase you so you have the advantage. They simply swoop in and land but an NPC will operate the turret on top giving you 360 degrees of shooting access and they will shoot you. So depending on your ship, you will need to play it smart and either do flybys until the ship is taken out or you can just circle around the enemy firing missiles or your guns until it's taken out. It's not super hard here. Now as for killing the ground NPs with your ship weapons, it's not hard, but depending on your guns and if they're wing mounted or if you have a center mounted gun, you'll need to aim manually and might find it easier to be in third person to shoot them as they're tiny and can be somewhat cumbersome to shoot at. The NPCs on the ground will shoot at your ship, so if you don't see them, if you hover over the campsite and move around a bit, if they're there, they'll start shooting at you and give up their location. Now the most difficult camps to do these at are the snowy ones simply because 9 times out of 10 when I've gone there, there's a snowstorm in progress and it brings visibility down pretty low. But it's still manageable so just be careful and take your time and most of the time the storm will let up enough to make it easier to accomplish your mission so just, just hang out. Another tip I would give is to pick up a multi-tool or tracker beam and if your ship is small enough you can just land next to the fallen NPCs, open your door or hatch and just tracker the bodies inside with Without stepping foot outside of your ship. This makes for good cover in case there's an NPC you happen to have missed. Also make sure to go around and check the area after you get that armor on as there's quite a few loot boxes at these camps with decent loot like more armor or mineables you can just put in your pocket and sell. Alright, so my last tip here is going to be to go to the river outpost as it's been the one that seems to have NPCs more often than not. I think it's because so many simply do not fly there, but I also have a quick guide on how to get to the river fast without that long flying method from New Babbage that many offer up. Again, in my guides, I use headings and visual markers to help you navigate to the river. Even if you've had issues trying to find it in the past, I guarantee you'll find it with my video or your money back. Anyway, that's going to do it for this quick guide on how to gear up for free and with minimal effort. Now, I hope you found this guide helpful. Remember to be kind to your fellow gamer, use all the tools at your disposal to make the job easier, and stay positive, citizens.